imagination? Are we doing a lot more posting up tonight? Oh, yes, sir. Uh, that's something we worked on in practice prior to this game was uh, getting some more post touches for everyone on the wing. Uh, they really couldn't guard us in the post in the first half, and I think that's what we took advantage of. Cal said he's starting to figure you out and what he needs to do. How much more comfortable do you feel? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling I'm getting real more comfortable with the offense, playing with uh, my teammates. I think we're all kind of clicking. I think this is one of our best games of the season. Uh, I think we all just click. You know, we're all making shots, just play together as a team. And like Cal said, he's kind of figure out. He's kind of started figuring everyone out. So that's really good for us. And hopefully Cal can start getting us guys clicking more. He, uh, he had complained in earlier games about you guys got a team down, but you didn't bury them. Tonight, it seemed like you guys did a pretty good job. Oh, yeah. We, we usually, in games like this, uh, prior to this game, I mean, we used to go up by 20 in the first half. The next thing you know, the second half, the next thing you know, we're only up by seven. Uh, so that's something Cal really been, been on us, pushing the lead up and up and up and being able to just pound them into the ground. I think that's something we did today. What did you say about your game that you had a career high tonight when you did hit a three? Uh, I mean, that's just something. I mean, I'm very versatile. I can really do pretty much everything. I get to the basket, post up, hit mid-range shots. Or, uh, like Cal said, I did a really good job of just being able to find open spots, being able to get in the post, score, score early baskets in, in the paint. So. I mean, it's good. I mean, just imagine if my three-point shot is hitting. So, like Cal said, just keep moving on with this game. Just keep uh, getting more comfortable. No, more shots going in will increase the assist. But you guys had 22 assists. First time, I think, in four games, you guys have had more assists than turnovers. Oh, yeah, that was good. I mean, he's been honest about turnovers. He really hates that. So, we're just kind of sharing the ball. Like I said, everybody was kind of clicking tonight. We had multiple guys in double figures. So, when that when that's happening, I mean, I'm pretty sure we're going to have a lot of assists. Uh, but it was a really good team win, and I'm really glad for my teammates. Kevin, I wonder if uh, you watch like the PK80 event or some of these big game teams playing each other, and you guys, you know, you haven't had the big opponents except for Kansas. So, do you miss that, not being in that spotlight? I mean, no, not really. I mean, just getting wins, uh, just playing as a team. Uh, like Cal says, I mean, just keep going game for game. We'll have those opportunities. We'll play good teams. Uh, like our SEC is one of the best conferences, so we're going to get a lot of good uh, good competition once it comes January. So, like Cal said, just keep moving game for game. Don't worry about none of the other stuff. Those teams lose and just focus on us and just make sure that we keep winning and keep getting better as a team. How many two point guards? Well, they're getting better. Uh, today, Quade did a really good job throwing the ball up. You see, we're kind of playing faster, getting up and down the court. So that's really good for us. Shea, he's doing, getting better, knocking those shots down. That's kind of what we want from him. And Quade, we just got to get him to be able to pass the ball like he is. And once he gets it back, shoot it. He's one of our best three-point shooters on the team, and he's showing that every game. So just gotta keep, make sure that they keep playing the right way and the way Cal wants him to play. How many had two nasty two dunks? Which mm -hmm. one you thought was better? Uh, I thought he was going to windmill one of them. Uh, I think that that been number one sports center. I told him that after the game. Uh, but I think that, sec that second one, I think he, he threw it on the wing. He got it back. That's the one he should have just took the two steps and windmilled. He said he was, but I knew he wasn't going to do it. But I think that was the best one. Why didn't he do it? He should have. Uh, he really won. I know he wanted the sports in the top ten. He should have just windmilled it. He can windmill easily. I don't know why he didn't do it. Kevin, is Cal giving you kind of specific directions on how many three-pointers he wants each of you guys to I mean, he, he's really big on once the ball gets in the lane and kicked out, that's when he kind of wants you to shoot threes if you're open. But he does, if the ball is swinging on the perimeter, he doesn't really want threes. He wants to get in the lane and be able to kick out for open threes because that's when everyone collapses. So he's, he, he don't mind us taking threes, uh, if, especially if we're wide open. Uh, me, Quade, Shea, uh, Hami can knock him down. PJ, he can knock him down. He's not shooting as many, but he can knock it down. So we got some guys that really can shoot the three-point shot. So we get, get in the lane. And, Get the defense collapse, we can be able to knock, knock down shots. How tough is it for you sometimes to feel like you need to turn it on and be that guy to score when things are kind of stagnant a little bit? Yeah, uh, Cal talked to me the other day about make sure there's not enough pressure on me and stuff like that. But I told him I'm fine. Um, I'm good with my team at. Uh, they know that sometimes I got to be able to get the ball if I'm not touching it. I know that sometimes uh, other guys are going to be able to score more than me. Uh, I don't really pay attention to that because other guys, this is such a talented team. You know, some guys going to be on that night, some guys going to be off. So I'm really happy my team's just winning. Uh, tonight was a really great win. Hopefully we uh, can capitalize on it. And But I think I'm getting better and better every day, and I'm just going to uh, grow on this. What was different for you tonight? I mean, I think I just came out just aggressive. I was getting to the basket, uh, knocking some shots down, getting to the free throw line, posting up early like Cal said. So. I mean, I think tonight just everyone just came out aggressive. We ain't really, we haven't played in, in a while, so we kind of ready to play against somebody else. So 
think it was a good win for us tonight. Can you come a few days of practice where you don't plan? And it's been said in the past by the past and the past that the practice is actually harder than the games. And if that's true, tell me why. Oh, yeah, our practice is way harder. I mean, if you come to our practice, you can definitely see we have one of the toughest practices probably in the country. I mean, we go at it with each other. I mean, it's five on five. It's really intense. We got a lot of talented players. So, I mean, it's five on five is going to be crazy. Fouling, uh, good defense, good offense, just all movement, talking trash, just getting physical. So, that's something we really do. We're really competitive. And if Cal don't like something, he's making us run. So, he's definitely on us in practice. We got one of the tougher practices.